Hi, my name is Kelly Puckett, and I am speaking with you today, Balsam Hill, about a wonderful opportunity to add that extra level of holiday flair and style to families and giving them that special feel of the Christmas time. And that would be a wonderful time where parents are looking for something to help protect their tree, whether it is protecting them from their animals, their children, without losing that touch of flair that we all so desperately want in our household during the holiday seasons because we entertain a lot during that season, whether it's our own family, friends, parties, there's always something going on. And no one wants to just have their tree in the middle of a playpen. We're actually seeing in our market analysis that a lot of parents and a lot of people are buying these white picket fences that you can buy through Amazon or Walmart that are very short um, and it doesn't really hold up as well. And their concern is it's a white picket fence that's really small and it kind of throws off the flow of their tree. Um, whereas our product, we would like it to be a wooden product um, with multiple different designs with different sizes as well with your height. Um, and then we can also add features to it. So for example, of a few designs on the top of my head is gingerbread houses. It could be a gingerbread village or candy canes, a beautiful snowflake scenery, Whoville when they're surrounding the tree or even a nativity scene um, for those who are a little bit more on the religious side. We can also add glitter, lights, anything to kind of make that come to light for you. Um, of course, we'd have our standards and then you can always add, which would of course increase those prices. Um, we are looking to help give that same vibe as Balsam Hill is providing the, their customers, which is this beautiful, realistic of farmhouse style, um, which is very in these days with our consumers. So of course we wanna get the right designs for our customers, but also providing a sturdy fence to help keep customers peace of mind. So they're not worried about those beautiful heirloom ornaments that their family has given them. Or you're like me and I collect ornaments every year with my family and I would hate for one of those to get destroyed. So right now, as I stated earlier, there's not a huge market for Christmas tree fences, except for the white picket fence. Either you can find on Amazon, at Walmart, or even people on Etsy are creating their own, but they're very basic um, and not really giving an extra flair to their consumers. And what's great is that if Balsam Hill decides to work with us is we are the only company that would offer a wide range of these fences and designs. So anyone can have that perfect holiday vibe or feel without worrying about their tree. Um, the pricing structure is a way to organize a price for a product or service for a company. Um, the customers could go on a basic starter model of the Christmas tree fence. Um, this would keep roughly a basic model would be about a hundred dollars. Whereas if you started adding more, it would increase. Um, but like, um, Balsam Hill, we would of course have a warranty with the, this product as well, just like Balsam Hills trees. We want to keep our customers feeling as if they're putting a good price um, on longevity. So right now, like I said, there's not a lot of companies out there. So that puts us at a pretty good standing on um, the position within the market. Um, it would allow a wide range of parents to not have to buy the white picket fences for Christmas and allow style and individuality. Um, which of course our price that we're looking at is not of low quality. We're looking at high quality um, at a reasonable price. Um, but we've also noticed with Balsam Hill, even a great way to 
really jumpstart this product would be Christmas at July, which is actually your company's biggest sale increase of the year. That is when you sell the most artificial trees and ornaments through your year. It is the best deal. Um. Um, we, of course, do have a budget. We predict this to change slightly. Um, the first quarter, we're seeing our research cost, um, owned media, earned media, paid media. These are all roughly about what we're thinking. They could adjust here and there. Um, we're hoping we can establish some of these things, such as um, our design cost, creative cost, uh, and kind of keep those very limited. Now what we can do as controls to see what's going on is we would really like our customers to give us feedback on our products. We thought about reaching out to some families on um, Instagram, Facebook, and more of the home decor families and giving them a try. Um, there's also a great other opportunity that I really like with Balsam Hill you guys do every year. And as you provide, your corporate social responsibility that you do is called every year is called festival of trees and what i love about this is that people are decorating trees and people are bidding on these trees in balsam hill we're already donating these gorgeous trees for people to decorate let's also give them that peace of mind of protecting and giving that added flair to their designs and help maybe even increase their bids um, I think that would be a wonderful way to help raise money for St. Apostles Festival of Trees for their hospital. And that is what I have. And I think, I really think you'd enjoy our partnership. Have a wonderful night.